Former Charlotte televangelist Jim Baker served five years in prison for fraud in the 1990s. Now he's under fire for claims made on his show about the coronavirus. This influenza that is now circling the globe, you're saying that silver solution would be effective. A guest on his current show was pushing a product that she claimed could kill the coronavirus. The New York's attorney general took notice and the state, as the state rather, is fighting dozens of cases of their own. She sent Baker a cease and desist order. Channel 9's Mark Becker has followed, of course, Jim Baker's rise and fall in Charlotte for decades now, and he's live with this latest pitch. Mark? Yes, Scott, I don't think Jim Baker had a website back when he had PTL here in Charlotte, but he's got one now and he's selling a lot of product on it. One that's been front and center lately is this one right here. Silver Solution. It's not cheap, but what would you pay for something that purportedly could prevent or even stop coronavirus? This influenza that is now circling the globe, you're saying that silver solution would be effective. Baker made the pitch during a show back in February as he spoke with a guest who made a remarkable claim about the product called Silver Solution. Well, let's say it hasn't been tested on this strain of the coronavirus, but it's been tested on other strains yeah. of the coronavirus and has been uh, able to eliminate it within 12 hours. The Silver Solution being sold on Baker's website now is basically colloidal silver. The problem is the National Institutes of Health says colloidal silver has no known function or benefits. And that's why New York's Attorney General sent Baker a cease and desist order, saying that any representation that Silver Solution is effective at combating or treating the current strain of coronavirus violates New York State law. Order Silver. Now, if all of this looks and sounds familiar, it shouldn't be surprising. I had people calling me from all over the country. Back in the mid 80s, Jim and then wife Tammy Faye Baker were on the air raising money for their PTL ministry in Fort Mill until Baker went to prison on mail and wire fraud charges. Well, it's uh, certainly reminiscent of the past and the past here in Charlotte. James Wyatt was a young lawyer in Charlotte back then. He since represented many clients charged with white collar crime and says if Baker keeps selling that silver solution cure for coronavirus, he may find himself in trouble again. He could be facing civil lawsuits seeking to stop him from doing that. He could, if it persists, and if it's egregious enough, face other things such as potential criminal charges. Now, I did try to reach someone with Jim Baker's ministry out in Blue Eye, Missouri, to see if they plan to continue to sell the Silver Solution as a cure for coronavirus, but we haven't heard back. Scott? Um, so, I had not seen the show, Mark, but is it common for a baker to kind of sell stuff, to pitch stuff? Is that kind of the point of it? Yeah, I think he started this show back maybe 10 years ago or so, and it's grown a little bit, right? But it's part marketing and part mm -hmm. ministry, and a lot of the product they do sell is what you might consider survivalist kind of stuff. This would seem to fit right into that mold, yeah. All right, thanks, Mark.